Jared Poland, froknowsphoto.com. And this is kind of, it's not a rant, it's more of a inspirational type of video and some words of wisdom uh, for you guys who are either starting out or who are six months in, a year in, two years, three years. It doesn't matter how far you are in as a photographer. I just think that people today feel that after six months, they should master something. They feel that they picked up a camera, that if they haven't gotten great images after six months, then they should give up. Well, you know, I'm, I'm 18 years into shooting. I started shooting at 13. I did start in auto. I didn't know what I was doing, but I figured it out because I kept shooting. I kept reading. I kept learning. I kept asking questions. I asked good questions. You know, I did my research and, you know, when it comes to anything, especially photography, you have to keep shooting. It's one thing to just sit there and read every website and watch every video, but it's another thing to get out there and actually firsthand see it and do it. If you have a question on how to do something, my suggestion is, you know what? Go out and shoot it. Try to figure it out because it's okay if you make mistakes. It's okay if the picture turns out too dark. It's all right if it turns out too light. What do you do? You figure out how to fix it. If you figure it out on your own, you are gonna pick this up much quicker than if you constantly ask somebody for the solution. The best way to learn with photography is to just get out there and do it. And if you run into some issues, then you Google it or you ask somebody who's a, a professional, or you ask them for some help at that point. But really, it's not going to happen overnight. It may not happen in a year. It may not happen in two years. I'm 18 years into shooting and I learn something new every day with photography. And I never am truly comfortable with the type of images I'm shooting. I'm always looking to make them better. There's little tweaks that I do. And this is something that, you know, like I said, isn't gonna happen after six months, two years, three years, four years. It can take a long time. But what you will see as you keep getting better or as you keep shooting and trying different things is that you get it. The, the light bulb goes off in the head one day and there's those times where you're out on a photo shoot and you just go, wow. I really know what I'm doing. When you can walk into situations and know your settings, or you know that you're gonna go out there and get solid images day in and day out, that is when you know that you've started to really understand it. And that's a great feeling, because I can tell you, when I walk into a situation today, a situation that I'm comfortable shooting or that I've done a ton of shooting in, and I kind of have a feeling on what I'm going for, uh, and I know my settings, and then I capture it, that feels great. That is something that, that, you know, I just, I can't explain it until you actually get there and do it. Now, I will say that if you're totally comfortable, you shouldn't really ever be totally comfortable in your shooting. You should always push your own limits because if you don't push your limits, you're just gonna stagnate. You're gonna shoot the same pictures over and over. If you don't step outside of your own box, if you don't try something different, you're really not gonna progress as a photographer. And I'll say, you never know when that job's gonna come by that says, hey, I need you to shoot X, and all you've ever done is shoot Y. But if you've shot Y a little bit, and you've practiced it, and then that job came along, well, you already have a step up. You're ready to do it. So the moral of the story and this whole video is it's not going to happen overnight. Don't give up. Keep trying, keep pushing your own envelope. Go out there and shoot. Get into a group of photographers and get out there and shoot because shooting is really what is gonna take you to the next level. Figure out the solutions to whatever problems you face because if you can figure it out on your own, not only does it feel better, but you learn it, it's ingrained in you, and you just, you just do it. So there you have it. That's a little rant, quick tip, slash, motivational speaking from me. Jared Poland, froknowsphoto.com. See ya. Are you subscribed yet on the YouTube channel? Well, click this subscribe button right here. Also click this box if you wanna be emailed every time I upload a new video so you can get the latest video uploads as they happen. And also, if you haven't signed up for the free user's guide, sign up right here, put your name, email address in here, hit send it, you will get a free ebook sent to your email as well as a link to a 60 minute long video on flash photography in the studio that Adam and I created. So please do that and we'll see you.